Hey guys, a cop right uh-huh. as we st- right, Guys, welcome show. back to Blue Shook. It's so, been a while since we played, but that's fine. That means that's it gonna means be, more comedy for you. It means it's gonna be fresh, like a like a, a head of lettuce. Guys, we're still on 1999 mode. I still believe it's going to be easy because it was easy before. Oh boy, what's this? What what's that's, it's, it's cowboy bo- It's cowboy bottle. Turns you into a cowboy, I guess. That's cool. What? Whoa! The- oh no, it's giving me a skin condition. Too many days on the prairie. Oh god. I, you should probably see a dermatologist. Oh no, no, just kidding. Fine. It's Bucking Bronco. Press to Bucking Buck Bronco. All right. Bucking Bronco is way better than it should be. No one understands how much I love it. Well, I didn't know uh, when they're... Because it's really bad news. No, because when they're floating, they take more damage, which I didn't take know. Take double damage. He's like, I'm going to try and do this as effectively as possible. I think as far as I need to go. There you go. Now... Black Marco is real good because, like, you use it with charge and it's uh, uh, comedy. Also, you save a load of ammo. Yeah. Well, yeah, because you're only using half as much if you think about it. I mean, you think about it. It eventually gets better, guys. Oh boy. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't realize it was. It was good so night. good because I let a friend borrow it, guys. Of this this copy of my game, and um, he was he was making use of it. And he had a mode on where, like, it told you how much damage you were dealing to people, which I thought was weird. That's a mode? Yeah. Well, not a mode, but, like, a setting, I guess. I don't know why you'd want that, but I little rock here. guess it's cool. Honestly, I took this one a little bit, too. Not I think there's a med kit by the sniper, uh, the carbine over there. I'm running away. All right, fair enough. Nobody talk to me. I'm invisible. I'm invisible. Invisible. I said I'm invisible, sir. Elizabeth? That guy had help. Okay. See, guys, that's the thing. You're always sort of in danger until... It, okay. That guy got rocked. Until people give you free stuff. Yeah, but it's it's a lot less on. However, the sniper rifle is not here yet. You don't get that yet. I meant carbine. Carbine's worth it. Because you will get a sniper rifle, guys, and it's going to be great. How much money do I have is a great question, because what the... Well, what's this guy doing? Also, apparently, if you just, um... If you, if you use, uh, Bucking Bronco, or if you use Delicus on someone who's Bucking Bronco, they just explode for no reason. Hmm. I'm trying to think of a time where I wouldn't want that. They're just like, ah, I've exploded. Kaboom. Oh, God, I've exploded. I'm, I'm singing. singing. All right. All right. Uh... But yeah. yeah. I'm do a lot of exploring here, guys, because I need to get money now. Serenity. Patriots, Prid. See, you open this, and then there's another, like, five lock inside, and it sucks. Is it right in there? I think so. Don't quote me. I'm not a quotable guy. I don't know. Okay, yeah. you shouldn't have quoted me, because I was wrong. Firebird. No. And what are you? What are you wearing now? What are your pants? Nope. Not gonna use that. See, one thing I've never figured out in this game. Silver eagle bag. All right. So you have oh, twelve hundred dollars. Not bad. I have five hundred dollars. I need still. Uh, one thing I learned. One thing I still haven't figured out about this game you. is whether or not um, freight hooks count as skylines. I think they probably do. I have to imagine it, because otherwise I don't see much of a point of putting them everywhere, you know? Yeah. Because, like, there are, a lot of go- there are a lot of pretty good upgrades for, like, uh, freight hooks and skylines and stuff. But, like, if it only affects skylines and doesn't affect freight hooks, then they're kind of useless. I agree with that. Oh, God, there's a crow, man. It's a crowman. It's a crow magnon. We just call them crows now? That's pretty cool. kind of hit. Oh, this guy's getting rocked. <laughs> You do that again. Thank you. <laughs> What's even going on? You have the bull rush thing on. It's apparently the funniest. The funniest. <laughs> oh, knock him off the edge. Knock him off the edge. Ah, uh, he was already dead. Whoops. 
<laughs> Gotta be honest, that was unbelievably effective. I think those tears of yours might come in handy next time. Don't forget the uh, book in the cannon. Yeah, I know, I'm not. You gotta get the book in the cannon. Can't just pull them out of thin air. I don't know, there's that book right there. I didn't know you could get it before you got the other thing. Yeah. I always do that the opposite way. Nice. They really jack up that. Now, I think it's I think it's supposed to be a, a spook. A, sp yeah. a spooky thing. Professional spookman. J. Phineas spookman. Uh, but yeah. He's gonna throw a bomb at this guy. He's gonna do something. I said it was gonna do something. I was about to say, I think that literally did nothing. Do you have super damage on or something that I missed? <laughs> like, that guy got rocked. I shot him a lot before. Oh. That's fair. <laughs> okay. Could use more salty salt, though. Put some salt on. Hey, there's some salt right there. Give me some money. There's salt right back there. It's all all over the place. Guys, what a great game this is. No, guys, I was a little sad because we haven't played this game in a while, and I really wanted to play it again. Because it's really just fun to play. I almost started up Bioshock 1 again. Because I wanted to play it so much. So anyway, there's a lot of corpses and stuff. Yeah. Pro tip, guys, if you want to be happy for the rest of your life, never make a pretty woman your wife, but also turn off all the radios. Well, this guy tells you about the book that you already have. Mr. DeWitt? Very functional sinks. Y yes. Look, that's what the code book deciphers. I'm sure of it. You know, it looks like First Lives Rerun. First Lives Rerun? Okay, use. Do it. Use the. Use the book. I'm just gonna hit the hat. Tip of the hat. I'm just gonna hit investigate the hat. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna tip. Everyone invest, investigate the hat. I'm just gonna tip, tip, tip of the hat to you. Oops, we got another one of these things. Ah. See, now we're at star level. Star! Stars! Yes. Sorry, my Resident Evil star. 3 impression. That's good. I like uh, it. So, I'm totally taking this RPG because the RPG is great. It's better than it has any right to be. Although, it will be replaced for a, a sniper rifle when that happens. Because the sniper rifle is my favorite. The sniper rifle is my favorite. Yeah, it's real good. The sniper rifle. I always hate open safes because you're like, I want the stuff that's on the ground. Yeah, that's a problem. <laughs> What's? I guess. I, yeah, I think my favorite is just the carbine because it's the world's most roundiest weapon. It's all rounder. I've read about. Uh, it's pretty all roundy. It's a professional all rounder. Look, they're reloading things there. Oh, that's cool. I never noticed that before. Uh, yeah, it's the whole Vox thing, guys. You'll learn about the Vox later. Look at that, look at that strapping gent. Strapping young lad. Dude, that looks like a Borderlands thing, straight up. Yeah. Dude, I always like how the, uh, the side of the, the RPG, like, sticks out. Yeah. It, it's like, it, it, like, actually goes out. See that? Yeah. But it wouldn't, it feels like it wouldn't work that way. That well, way. they could, they could zero it in that way. That's true. That's a good point. Right, as you see, guys, there's dudes here. Enemy dude spotted. Dump to dump. Hey, who's that guy? Oh no! Oh no! I didn't use that. Well, goodbye. Gotta be a little cautious, guys. That's all there's to it. <laughs> Gotta be a little run away sometimes. You really did, did, did the Lord's work. Oh no, he hates that happen to a rookie. I gotta be honest, I like seeing it because he really did me a favor and then he got to die the most uh, honorable death. The most honorable death? Killing yourself. Killing yourself after helping me. Guys, don't do it. Anyway, uh. Um, doing what he loves. Uh, I'm gonna kill you with the straight up bullets. Guys, headshots still do a uh, very satisfyingly large amount of damage. Yeah, this is really good. So like I'm just killing these dudes. I didn't. I don't have time, by the way. Oh, I don't either. Sorry, I thought <laughs> you were doing it. No, I should. I should have. I'm getting real close to one of the funnest parts of the game, though, guys. Yeah. I usually take a little too much time in this area. I could have just run that one. We had to click this thing. You had to had to pull this lever. Note this sky hook. Yeah. Now she is a skyhook. Ta-da. The first time I did it, I was like, 
Why does she have one? Keen eye of yours could find some ammunition lying around. I sure could use it when there's trouble. Now she'll start throwing ammunition at you. Yay! Booker! <laughs> ah! I wasn't ready! <laughs> They're made of metal, you jerk! Line's clear. Line's clear. Alright. Yippee! Oh god, I almost jumped to my death. I said yippee. This was a terrible idea. Yippee! Now, the getting back is always the harder part. Because getting there is not too much. Of. I'll go that way. Grow up. So, here's where you, we're going to the Hall of Heroes, where all your heroes are hauled. They're, they're hauled. They're hauled away. Alright. This could be potentially difficult. Uh, but there's about to be... I'm actually going to replace this pistol. Uh, because, guess what? I'm going to find a pistol again, I bet. Where do you think you're going to find one of those, though? On anyone who dies. So they're playing some kind of music. Hall of Heroes is well known for being a great place where everyone's happy. Yeah, nothing bad happens to Hall of Heroes, that's for sure. What? Hall of Whores? Booker, sniper rifle. Yeah, give it to me. Oh, you have it? Alright. Nice. So anyway, if you see any flashes, you gotta shoot them with the gun. Because that's what you're doing. See, that's the guy. Yeah, they really, uh, do that. They really make it obvious, like, there's a sniper boat. Yes. It's, not, it's, they don't want, they don't want to make it too hot for you. Now, here's the deal, guys. They said, man, that fucking Bronco didn't work too well before. Now that I have this thing, it's gonna work just fine. I know that didn't look so great. You're doing your best. You're doing great. You're doing... You're doing good. You want a soda? Now they really love jacking this music right here. Bye, bye. What the heck is the deal? You know, I'm just gonna let him come to me. Uh, As a man with an RPG, I feel like it's best that we do this at close range. What, there's a thing up there? Oh, yeah. Oh, get up there. There's a uh, electro gate that you can get to. Really? Yeah. I never do that. I've never done that. Yeah, it's it's uh, like right at the end of the. Uh... Well, obviously it's gonna come back. Oh yeah. Anyway, guys, you come back. Sorry for the spoiler. What? Spoiler: You don't die here. Game continues. I mean, you can die. That's true. But not. It's not permanent. It's not cannon. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, she loves giving the sniper ammo here. That's the best. Yeah. See how, see how I really lined up that shot despite being shot at a zillion times? That'll happen when you're a master snipesman. Yeah, I have a unique set of goals. Uh, oh god, there's a crow. Or there's leaves. Yeah, I guess there are leaves. You know, I didn't think we were. I didn't think we would have a leaves. Thing. I didn't think leaves. No, no one. No one thought leaves. So I, I guess I was assuming it'd be something found in the game. Oh no! Not. No, the thing is, the uh, sniper was kind of like the finger of God. Yeah, it's just it's the lance, of, lance of the Lord. Is that fair to say? No, I think that's really appropriate, actually. I actually really like it. Now I'm hoping she's going to give me more sniper ammo at some point. Cause I really use it. I'll tell you that. <laughs> anyway, these guys were all rocked. So these dudes were in some kind of super army called, uh... The super army? The, the American army, but, like, super duper. Alright. I don't know where you would have seen an electro dude. Oh, it's, uh, go back... Down there, it's right uh, on that corner to your right. Really? Yeah. What does it do? You zap that, and there's a gate right there. Wow, that's really hidden there. Yeah. I've never. I never, I never noticed it. I didn't notice it until my second playthrough. Yeah. Also, you can go back to the uh, the toy shop. Um, on. I did know that. Yeah, you can go back, and there's a, there's a thing you can do there. You can open a gate and look at stuff. 
I think there's an infusion in there. There's a heater, I know that. There's also a very suspicious bookstore that I've never figured out if there's anything there. Where's that? Oh boy. It's in the same place. Stand for God and sweet test fatherland. Sweet test. Sweet test. So they're all talking, but here's Mr. Salt Machine, so everything's gonna be fine. Hello, I'm Mr. Salt Machine. Hello. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Feels good. Boy, do I need more money, though. I just remembered this is the time I need the money, guys. Oh, that's right. You're getting there. I'm close. I'm feeling real good. Guys, Feel saying, better than that guy. I'm saying, why do you need all the money? Should be obvious. There's a box one you missed. That one? Yeah, right there. Who's that guy? Go. That was really unfortunate, by the way, what happened to that man. Come on. We're wasting my time. Because his head exploded? <laughs> the music was like, let's go. Okay. Bit -a -bit -a There's a big foe. Okay, you did it, though. I think those guys are supposed to be, like, sneaking up on you or something. Like, you're not supposed to know. I think they're just supposed to be, uh. About them. What I do. So, anyway, there's a lot of talking here that you probably won't hear. This? Corporal DeWitt proved his worth on the field that day. Corporal DeWitt. Slate? Is that you? Old Chief. You've always been different, haven't you, Booker? You crave no glory. Look, I see you're caught up in some kind of jam here. If you could see fit to let <laughs> no, us know like where they like... keep this shock I see, uh... And we'll... So you got some stuff going on. There's a whole lot of stuff. Probably will. There's going to be trouble. Is there? I think we're about to have a lot of fun. Bum, bum, bum. Oops! That guy was instantly possessed. And killed himself. That's not where I would have gone with it. Oh, they all killed themselves. Nice. So anyway, guys, I have this RPG I'm going to use the ammo for. I mean, why wouldn't you? Now, I really like the RPG in this. I like the, like, the crank. I like I like the uh, grenade launcher in Bioshock more. Also, they were brutally slaughtered. I don't know if anyone saw that. Just give us the shot, Jack. Just give us a shot, Jack. Give us a shot, Jack. Pro tip, guys. I don't, you didn't see it, but I mined that door with possession, and so if you mine with possession, they instantly kill themselves. Yeah, because it can't affect more than one person at a time. Yeah, so they just so go if it, So if it does... Like, it'll constantly be, like, jumping. And it was awesome. Guys, possession's the best thing in the game. That's why I'm saving up all this money. Saving yep. up all your money? Because literally I'm going to get the most important possession-related upgrade ever. You could ever possibly achieve. Oops, another infusion. Put into my magic. Just with the doctor order. Just with the doctor order. Real close here. More magic. So you guys, I'm, I'm falling over resources, and this is the hardest mode. <laughs> like, if it wasn't for the fact that I needed $1,600 coming up, I would be like, I'm in zero danger. I still feel a little bit like I'm not in danger, but, I, like, I'm going to spend all of my money that's used for reviving. So, all right. I'm getting out of here. All right. Uh, let's read this. Ten soldiers, don't fight wars. Men do. Ten soldiers don't fight wars. It's a new song written. Yeah, I think it's good. Both bandages and ammo, but right terror is, terror is not always at hand. My terror is not always at hand. Uh, I really want to. That's cool looking. What is? Battle wounded knee. So, guys, you have to do both of these. He acts like you don't at first, but you do. He's like, like come legit. meet me at Wounded Knee, and he's like, just kidding, Boxer Rebellion. Did I say Wounded Knee? Because I meant Boxer Rebellion, too. What happened there? What didn't happen there? What? Ah! I really got him right to the torch. Ah! Look at that Chang Dao. Look at it. Chopping the heads off of women. Well, that's I guess that's a man with a What is he going to do with the Chang Dao? Also, employees only. They really hide these doors. 
It's not Disneyland, guys. Hidden poison. Does Disneyland, um, does Disneyland not have employees? Is that it? Yeah. Grants brief invulnerability when gaining health from snacks. I can understand why you'd want that, but I'm not going to do that. Wait, invulnerability from getting snacks? That's great. It's not that great. Dude, there's snacks all over the place. You get brief invulnerability. So it would be... Assuming... Bri it's, it says brief, but it's, it's a lot more than you'd think. It probably is, but also it assumes that I'm eating while I'm fighting, which I'm not. I mean, I could start, but... What are you supposed to be? I can't believe that missed. Just kidding, I can believe it. I take it back. I believe it. I wasted too much ammo on that. Anyway, this always looks really cool, guys. Yeah, no, I always like I always like that. I like it that diorama. That's the the Ching flag king? How do you pronounce yeah, uh, King? I think it's Jing. No, because it's Q I N. Yeah. So it'd be like King. I thought it was less of a Q set. Was yellow I think it's Shin. And eyes that did oh boy. No one wants to hang out with a racist. George Washington, come on. Come on, George. Get it together. Comstock led the Colombian troops. Comstock wasn't there! Wow! Comstock was there! Pretty sure you get a hand cannon here. No, you don't get a hand cannon. Hand cannon still fainting. That's not true. That's where you get your first one. Pretty sure. I, by the way, I just killed a lot of people there. Oh, fireman. Yeah, guys, this is kind of. Uh, I remember back when I watched uh, Tom go through this the first time. This is the first time I really learned the usefulness of the RPG. Unfortunately, I don't have it reloaded right now. So I'm just gonna have to shoot him to death with this gun easily. Well, that's his own thing going on. Okay. That hurt bad. That hurt bad. That was almost a very uh, bad situation. I admit that didn't go as smooth that could have. You went alright. M I C K E Y. Alright. M O U C Murkrubles. Alright, everyone's dead. These guys were literally obliterated. Fall oh, right. You see the man that Comstock wishes he was. A real I don't want to do this, Slate. Just give me I don't want to do this, Slate. Slate, you don't got to do this. Slate, cut it out. Me. You don't got to do this. Come and look for me amongst the ghost dancers. Who are the ghost dancers? The ghost dancers. Wounded knee. He means us to head to the other Who is they fight. fighting in the wounded knees? Can you hear uh, the I think. Like the Sioux? I think so. But we are the true patriots. Nice. This has got to be the end of the episode. Yeah, we'll say it is. Guys, we're going to see you on the next thrilling episode of Bioshock. Continue.